Alhamdulillah, Alhamdulillah, Rabbil Alameen, wa salatu wa salamu ala nabijina Muhammadin, wa ala alihi wa ashabihi wa ajwazihi ajma'in. Amma ba'd fa'audhu billahi min ash-shaytan ar-rajim, bismillahi rahman rahim Rabbish rahli sadri, wa yasir li amri, wa hlu luktatam min lisani yafqahu qawli, Rabbi zidni ilman ajma'in insha'Allah. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala increase in all of us knowledge. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Nice to see you brothers and sisters. We did finish uh, reading the lesson and now we'll come to the exercises. Tamarinu, page number 43. Ajib anil as'ilatil atiyati. Answer the following questions. Maza rada tullabuan yarifu. Translation, brother. Maza, what did the student want to know? Huh? No, huh? Arafa yarifu, to know. Huh? Arada, wanted. Students wanted. It's madi. What did the student want to know? Huh? What will be the answer? No, because it is Mahdi, we should use Mahdi. Huh? Either you say Aradu, they wanted, or you will say Aradat Tullabu, because once you use Tullabu as a file, then the verb has to be singular. Remember, new sentence. Huh? Fine. And Yarifu Natijatal Ikhtibar Shahriji. They wanted to know the result of the monthly exam. Huh? Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Inshallah, you'll be able to write it. Arasaba ahdun fi hadal fasli? La. Lam 
Yara Sub. Huh? How will you write it? That would be nice. Huh? We should try to use Lam. Huh? La Lam Yara Sub Ahdun. 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 Because that is the file for Yara Sub. Remember, Brother Hassan, Rasava Yarsubu is intransitive. It is intransitive. Huh? Doesn't need mafulun bi. Huh? Okay. Manal ladhi karaal ayati. Who read the ayah? Who was he? Huwa arifun. Mashallah. Wa maza kala lahul mudarisu. Kala lahul mudarisu. Mashallah. Inna ka kadiyun. Jaidun. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Inshallah, you'll be able to write it. Huh? And after you write it, you can always check your answers with the Hello Tamarin, inshallah. Writing is extremely, extremely important, brothers and sisters. Manal ladhi arada ayin yakhruja min al fasli asamaha lahul mudarrisu bil khuruji. Translation, brother. Who's the one who wanted to go out of the class? Uh, did the mudarris allow him uh, uh, to go out? Uh, see, Bil Khuruj, brother and sister, is a master. Now change it in English into infinitive, which is master muawal. Did he allow to go? Bil Khuruj is going out. But in English, we won't say going out, we'll say to go. Are you with me? What is to go? Ain yakhruj. Are you with me? Ain yakhruj. So, Master Mual is very important for us to keep it in mind, yeah? inshallah. Okay. Who, who was the one? Who was Mansur? Huh? Yeah. Again, let's use the lam. Walam yasmah. What will you say? Walam yasmah lahu. Al Mudarrisu, Bil Khuruj. Lam Yasmah Lahu, Bil Khuruj. Now comes number two. We have done it. Huh? Do you think we have done it? Did we do the exercise? No. Katala Yaktulu Huwa Katilun. We didn't do it? I think we did it. She said, Maimuna remembers. Okay, we'll try to do it quickly, inshallah. First, asariku, ismun, asariku is a noun. Ismun means noun. Yadullu means it indicates Allah man kama bi sarikati. But what is sarikati? Stealing. Master. Huh? Saraka yasriku sarikatun is your master. Okay? Now remember, kama means to stand up. But kama b, if you use kama b, means to perform. Huh? So, you know, you, we will have to go to the dictionary and understand the various usage of kama with different half chairs, the meaning changes. Kama is to stand up. Huh? But kama b, if you say kama b, means he performed, executed something. Huh? So, it's a noun which indicates who performed the stealing. Who performed the stealing. Means, who steals. Fine, brother. Okay, nice work, brother. Who are, are you all ready? Mushtaqun. Mu has come. So, it has to be one of the two, ism file or ism maful. So, what is the verb? Ishtaka, mashallah, mashallah. What is the word, brothers and sisters? Huh? Ishtaka. Ishtaka. Form. Ishtaka. Form. Eight. Alif and ta is a iftala. Okay, brother. What is the root? This is your Mahdi. Now what is the root? Shakaka. Mashallah. 
Keep this in mind. Whenever Ain Kalima and Lam Kalima come together, the Ain Kalima loses its vowel sign and it is replaced with Sukun first. Huh? When you replace the vowel sign of Ain Kalima with Sukun, then the Shada comes in. Are you with me, brother? So even if there is a Kasra, it will get a Sukun. If it is a Fata, it will get a Sukun. Are you with me, brother of the Samad? And then we have, brothers and sisters, see, the Ain Kalima lost its vowel sign huh? in order for us to assimilate. Huh? And then this became, are you with me, brothers and sisters? Huh? This is how it happens. Huh? Okay. So now the thing is, Ishtaka, what will be the mudarya? Yash? Again, yash takku. Now, I'm trying to devote a little time here so that in future you will become more strong with, with these kinds of verb. Huh? Brothers and sisters, yash takku, and it will become ishtaka, it will become yash. Taku. Now tell me what is actually inside this verb. Yash. Ta. Ifta ala. Yafta ilu. Yafta ilu. So yashta khiku. Now again, ain kalima, lam kalima are same. So the Ain Kalima will lose its vowel sign. Are you with me? So then it will become Sukun and then we have a Shadda. So we have to be careful in our mind when you say Yashtaku, actually it is Yashta Kiku. Huh? Because it is Bab Ifta'ala. Ifta'ala Yafta'il. Brothers and sisters, Arabic means thinking. You must think deeply. Huh? Okay. Now, yashta. Yash. Taqiku. So it became yash. Taqku. Now, whether it is ism fa'il or ism maful, the same thing will apply. Okay. Make it ism fa'il. It will be mush taqiku. But then again that kasra will come into sukun. So it will be mush taqku. Fine, brother. What? Huh? Mushtakun, I will write down. Mushtakun. Huh? Now, which is actually ism file? Mushtakun. Make it ism maful. Mushtakun. Again, the Ain Kalima will lose its vowel sign. Okay? So, what will happen now, brother? So what is the difference between this and this? No difference. But our mind will tell us huh? which is which. Huh? Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Huh? Huh? Little careful on this. So here, brothers and sisters, we have huh? who are mushtakun. Okay. Ishtakka is to drive. Huh? Ishtakka is to drive. So brother, who are mushtakun? What kind of a Noun is this. Is it some maful or is some file? It is some maful. It is drived or driven. Yes, yes. So, huwa mushtakun, it is drived or it is driven. Min saraka yasriku. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? It's very easy. I thought I explained you properly so that when you read, inshallah, it will be clear. Wa yusamma. What is yusamma? What kind of a verb is this? Majhul, mashallah. This is madi mudarya. Mudarya, okay. What is madi? Samma. Madi lil ma'lum. Al fi'lul madi lil ma'lum. Samma, okay. And then, brothers and sisters, what will be the mudarya? 
you send me. Are you with me? Quickly conjugate so that I refresh your mind. Samma, Sammaya, Samma, Mashallah. We should always be quick, huh? Samma, and then here, Sammat, and then Sammata, and then Sammaina. Got the idea? Alhamdulillah. Okay, brother. You Sammi, you Sammi, Yani, you Sammuna, brother. You Sam. Muna, you sum Muna, okay? And then some to some me, to some me, yani, you sum me, huh? Keep the verb in front of your mind, and then we, according to the 14 uh, forms, inshallah, we will be able to do it, okay? Okay, brother, some uh, make it majhul. Some me, Are you all comfortable? Uh, I will write on one more time, brother. Brother Ali Hada, you missed this, brother. Uh, you will have to catch up. Huh? How to make majhul? I'll talk to you in the break. Huh? Samma will become summi. As soon as you gave ain kalima kasra, the ya opens up. Huh? Summiya. Okay, can you get, brother? Summiya. Summiya. Summu, summu. What did I tell you? Do not ever forget to forget. <laughs> what is to forget? Nasiya. So do not forget Nasiya. Do not forget to forget. Okay? Nasiya, Nasiya, Nasu. Always keep that in mind. So summiya, summiya, summu. And then summiyat. Summiyata, summina. Fine, very good, brother. And here it was, yusammi. What was it, brother? This was yusammi. Huh? Yusammi. How will you describe it? Fairun, mudarion, marfuun, wa alamatu rafaihi, dammatun, mukaddara. Alhamdulillah. Okay, now yusammi. Huh? This is your. Fialun mudariun lil ma'alum active voice make it into passive voice you sam ma one more time I'll repeat brother and sisters fu i la Huh? And then, brothers and sisters, Yuf Alu. Huh? This majhul, we should, because it's a new thing, we just learned it a few days ago. We have to keep on reminding ourselves and we must practice, inshallah. Brother, Fu Ila, what is the pattern? Then Ain Kalima gets a Kasra, and Fa Kalima gets a Dhamma. Okay, now if the verb is uh, more than three letters, four letters, five letters, six letters, we have to be careful that Ain Kalima will get a Kasra and everything else before Ain Kalima in Madi will get Dhamma. Huh? You will remember that. It, they will get Dhamma. If there is a Sukun, what do we say? We say Sukun se rahene de. Let it live in peace. <laughs> Don't touch it. Okay. Now, yuf alu. Okay, brothers and sisters, what is on Ain Kalima? Fata. Huh? Because Ain Kalam is where we try to decide what to give in front of Ain. Okay. Alamatu mudharia will be you. Okay. And then anything before Ain Kalima, if it is a mutaharik, means if there is a vowel sign, it will get a fata. If there is a sukun, leave it. Are you with me, brother and sister? So I gave you an example from the Quran. Brother, I'll repeat it. Tawaffa. He caused someone to die. Tawaffa. Okay? And what will be Mudarya? Yata 
wafa. Brother, I'm, I'm repeating this so that you are fresh, inshallah, when we go forward. Now, if I make it majhul, Sister Madina, first will be my ain kalima. And then the ya will come out. And what will happen to tawa? How many dhammas? All of them. Huh? Because there is, they are all mutaharik. There is no wow, uh, no sukun. So it will become tuwufiya. Got the idea? Tuwufiya. See how? I gave two dhammas here. Because it was Sister Sumaya tawa. No sukun. Had there been a sukun, I would have left it. Huh? Okay, brother. Now, I come here, mudarya. The mudarya is that fa kalima will have a fata. So I gave fa kalima fata. And the alamatu mudarya will get dhamma. And the, anything else, if it is mutaharik, will get a fata. So put a fata here. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? You, Ramatu Mudarya. Ain Kalima is fa, got a fata. Anything else before Ain Kalima will get a fata. So you got Yuta Waffa, okay? Tawaffa Madi Lil Maalum. Yatawaffa Mudarya Lil Maalum. Tuwuffiya. Madi lil majhul and yutawaffa mudariya lil majhul. Got the idea? Keep that in mind. Okay, brothers and sisters. So, we come back to samma summiya. You sammi became you samma. Now, this is very common verb. Uh, it comes in use all the time. It was called. Or it is called. Summiya means it was called or it was named. Yusamma means it is called or it is named. Fine, brothers and sisters. Let us try to see your knowledge. Yusamma. Yusammayani. Yusammauna. MashaAllah. Yusam Mauna. Are you with me, brother and sister? Yusam Mauna. And then, Hiya, Tusamma, Tusammayani, Hunna. Yusammayina, mashallah. If you keep that verb in front of us, it's very easy, you know. Okay. Very good, brother and sisters. So we are here. Huwa mushtaqku. Min saraka yashriku wa yusamma. And it is called, what is it called? Ismu file. Huh? Very good. Ismu file. Ismun masugun. What is masugun? We are going to learn all these things in the next lesson. Huh? Masugun is ism maf'ul. What is it? Ism maf'ul. And how is it made, brothers and sisters? Very important verb. Saga. Ajwaf. What will be the mudarya? Ya. Sugu. Like qala yakulu. Qala yakulu. Very good. What will be the amar? What will be the amar? Sugh, like kul, sugh. Saga he formed. Sugh means form. F O R M, form. Okay. And brother, what will be the ismu file of Saga? Saigun. What will be the ism file? Sa E. Gun. What will be the ism maf'ul? Masugun. Thing which is formed. Are you with me? Masugun. Huh? Ma. Su. 
one. Masugun. Huh? We are going to learn in the next lesson all these things. And they are extremely important. Okay, brothers and sisters. So, Ismofail is the noun formed. Huh? Ismun masugun means no, noun formed, fashioned, patterned. You can also say pattern. Huh? Huh? Lima waka'a minhu fialu. Brother, lima means to which or to whom. Huh? The action occurs from it. Waka huh? means, brothers and sisters, hadatha, to occur. Write down hadatha. Hadatha, to occur, to happen. Okay. So what happens, brother? In our simple way, we can say, Ismu file is the doer of the action. He does the action. Huh? That is the, our simple explanation, brother. Wahua ala wazani, and it is on the wazan or pattern of fa'ilun. Now, alimun, jahilun, zahibun. Alhamdulillah, you are all very strong in this. You should have no problem, inshallah. Okay. Istakhraj min ad darsi asma al fa'ilin al waridata fihi, wa zakur ma kulli wahidin minha, al fi'al al ladhi. Okay, what is this? Fi'al al ladhi. Properly pronounced with, with Hamdatul Wasal. How will you pronounce, Sister Hafsa? Ushtuk. <laughs> what will you pronounce? Ushtuk. <laughs> Madi. Everything Dhamma. Ushtukka. Now, what is actually? Ushtu kika. Are you with me? Ushtu kika. But then it became ushtukka. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? If you wish, you can write down ushtu kika. Write it down, brothers and sisters, next to it, so you know exactly how it is formed. And this is madi lil majhul. I will write down, brothers and sisters. This is the one, huh? Do not give a sign of Hamdatul Kata because it is Hamdatul Vasal. Ush Tu Ki Ka. Ain Kalima lost the vowel sign, so it became Ush Tukka. Are you with me? It became Ush Tukka. I hope you understand, inshallah. Very good. <coughs> Ushtukka minhu ala nahwil ta'ali. Means it is derived from it, from the verb on the following way. Ismu fail sahrikun. A fellow ladhi ushtukka minhu, ushtukka minhu saraka yasriku. So whenever you will see in this lesson, you will try and write down the verb. You will see ismu file, ism maful, and you will write down the verb. Huh? Fine. Okay, number three, brothers and sisters. Sug. What is sug? Fialu amran mabniun ala sukun. Fine. Asma'a mafulun bihi. Wahuwa mudaf. Fa'ilina, fa'iluna, fa'ilina, fa'ilina. Min al afwal al atiyati. From the following verbs. Katala. Yaktulu wahua katilun. Okay. Jahala. To become ignorant. Huh? Or be ignorant. Okay. Jahala. Yajhalu wahua jahilun. Rakaa yarkau wahua rakiun. Alima yalamu wahua alimun. Okay. Sajada yaschudu wahua sajidun. And you know how we have sister's name. Huh? Sajida, but it is Sajida too. It is still stem file. And we forgot, last time I said Arifa is a stem file, but Aisha is also a stem file. Sister Aisha, your name is also from a stem file. What is the verb? Asha Yaishu. Aishun. And from Aishun, make it Muannas. 
Aisha Tun. But when you make it into a proper noun, it becomes Aisha Tu. Huh? Okay, because ladies cannot take two tanween. It's too heavy for them. So they do a lot of other work. <laughs> okay, so we give them only one dhamma. Aisha tu. Okay. Rakiba yarkabu wahua. But tell me, isn't it easy? It's so be- beautiful and easy. Huh? Alhamdulillah. Oh, it's all halwa puri, brother. <laughs> Fine. Jalasa yajlisu wahua. Now you know we came across this noun uh, in uh, le- book one, most probably in lesson number three. Al waladu jalisun. Wal mudarrisu waqifun. So you know these are all ism file, but at that time we dare not go in detail. Huh? But now we can go in detail, brothers and sisters. Shahida yashadu wa huwa shahidun. Laiba yalabu wa huwa ma'in. Sa'ala yas'alu wa huwa sa'ilun. See how sa'ilun is written. Sa'i came, then Hamza will get a kursi of ya. Huh? Okay? How, how will you write down sa'ilun, brother? Sa e. So now this ya is the kursi of Hamza. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Watch the spellings of Hamza as you come across and think over it. And it's very easy to identify or understand why she gets different chairs, you know, wow, alif, and ya. <coughs> Brother, where are we now? Akala yakulu wa huwa akhilun. Khadama yakhdimu wa huwa khadim. Kariha yakrahu wa huwa karihun. Akala yakilu wa huwa akhil. Baraa yabrahu wa huwa bariun. How will you write down bariun? How will you write down bariun, brothers and sisters? Bari. Okay, and now you, you will not put two dots here, brother. Huh? Do not put two dots. That will be confusing. Huh? It's only a chair, so we remove the dots. Huh? Brother, bara'a, what is the meaning of bara'a? To create, khalaka. Huh? Bara'a means to create. The rest of the meanings were clear, inshallah. Kariha means to dislike something. Huh? Okay? Inshallah. Amara yamuru wa huwa amirun. Sahibul amar. What is amirun? Sahibul amar. The one who commands. Commands. Huh? Fine, brother. Ayyin. What is ayyin? Fellow Amrin Mabnun Allah Sukun. Ayyana, you ayjinu, ayjin. Bab Tafail. Please remember, huh? Bab Tafail. Form 2. Very good, brothers and sisters. Now, ayjin asmal fa'ilin fima yali. In what follows, brothers and sisters? Man. Katilu Aliyin radiallahu anhu. Where is the ismul file? Katilu. Katala yaktulu. Inshallah. Very good. If you have highlighter, highlight the, the ism file. Huh? I, I always you know, feel uh, that if you highlight ism file, so when you are revising, you know that thing will come right in front of you. With more Prominence, inshallah. Okay. La tanhar. Brother, la tanhar. Asai la. Mafulun bihi. What is the sa'ila? One who is asking. Usually it refers to beggar. One who comes to beg. Or somebody who, who needs help from you. Okay. 
he is some in a desperate situation. So he is asking something from you. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, La tanhar. What kind of a la is this? La annahiya. What is tanhar? Fe'lun mudariun majzumun bisukun. Huh? Majzumun bisukun. Okay. So, so sa'ilun is a petitioner. Huh? One who comes with some kind of a uh, request for you. So, la tanhar, do not scold or tongue lash or rebuke, reprimand or drive him away. Do not drive away the one who has come to ask your help. Uh, la tanhar, asa'ila. So, you will say, la tanharis sa'ila. La tanharis sa'ila. Very good, brother and sister. Number three, aladaika. What is the meaning of ladaika? Aindaka. What is the meaning of ladaika? Aindaka. Shahidun. Do you have a witness? Alamatakulu. For what you say? Do you have a witness? Hmm? Fine. You got the idea of the Shahida Yashadu. Huh? Fine, brother and sister. Who are Majusiyun? What is the meaning of Majusiyun, brother and sisters? Fire worshipper. The person who worships fire. So, what is the meaning of Majusiyun? I means that is to say, Abidu Narin. Abidu Narin. So, brothers and sisters, here we have Abidu. Abada Yabudu Bahuwa Abidun. Very good. Zalika Rajulu Jalisu. Okay, brother, Jalisu has come. Amamal. Huh? Merhabi Alimun Kabirun Min Afghanistan Afghanistan Can you imagine 40 years ago Dr. Abdurim thinks of Afghanistan so it's very important <laughs> okay okay but then sister let us analyze this it's a simple sentence Zalika what is Zalika Mubtada, mashallah. Brother Abdul Samad, what is Arrajulu? Madal, brother. And tell me next one, what is Jalisu? Ajalisu? Naat. What is it? Naat. Are you with me, brother and sister? Amama Zarf. Merhabi Mudafilehi. Fine, brother and sister. And where is our Khabar? Alimun is your Khabar, mashallah. Alimun is your khabar. And what is kabirun? Naat. Min Afghanistan. Jaan Majur. Got the idea? Alhamdulillah. Excellent. Alaibu kurati kadamin anta. Translation? Are you a soccer player? Are you a soccer player? Okay. So laibu here is? Ism file, brother. And it is mudafa. Okay. This is a very nice example, brother. Zannul Akhili. Khairun huh? Yakinil Jahil. How will you translate, brother? Zannul Akhili. Brother Hassan. Khairun Min. No, Zannu means the guess. The guess of Akhil is better than the certainty of an ignorant person. Are you with me? The guess of the akil, intelligent person, is better than the certainty of ignorant person. Huh? So, but the zannu is your master. Zanna yadunnu, zannun. It's your master. Okay, analyze it, brother. Zannu, muftada, wa huwa mudaf. And then, al akili, mudafilihi. Where is the khabar? Khairun is your khabar. And here, Khairun is Ism Tafdil. Huh? Okay, fine. And it is a comparative degree because Min has come. Huh? Okay. Min Harfjar Yakini Ism Majroor Wahua Mudaf and Jahil Mudafili. How many Ism files are there? Two, Two mashallah. Huh? Very good, brother. Fal to Zalika. I did that. Fal. To Zalika. Okay. Analyze, brother. What kind of a sentence is this? Jumla failure. Where is the verb? 
فعل سكون سكون ها where is the verb فعل why سكون brother متحرك pronoun what is it متحرك pronoun comes and the lam kalima gets a سكون فعل of ذلك and what kind of vow is this Brother, if I say what kind of vow is this, it means it's not vowel. It is hal. Huh? It is vowel hal. Wa ana karihun lahu. While I disliked it, I did it while I disliked it. Kariha yakrahu. What is it, brothers and sisters? Karihun comes from kariha yakrahu. Fatihul andalusi. Huh? Brother, this is the person. This is the one of the most famous commander in chief of Muslim army, Tariq bin Ziyad. Uh, you should read the history. Uh, do you know his, his background? I'll tell you very briefly, brother. He was sent to Spain. Okay, so he landed on the shore of Spain, and what did he tell? Burn the ships. We, we are not going back. We are staying here. Either we move forward or in our struggle, we sacrifice our lives. So when you, when you see the ships, then people can say, oh, we can go back. Huh? No, we are not going back. Can you imagine somebody doing like this? So, and uh, you know, this, this gave uh, the army a very strong uh, incentive, zeal, you know, to move forward, and then they conquered the opposition. And Jabal Tariq, Gibraltar is Jabalul Tariq, huh? mountain of Tariq. So Gibraltar comes from there, yes. So whether how many some files are there? Two. Huh? Fatihu. Huh? Okay, that Fatihu is Muftada, and the next Tariku is your Khabar. Okay. Fataha Yaftahu wa huwa Fatihun. Taraka Yatruku wa huwa Tarik. Tarik, Taraka means to hammer somebody, to strike. Huh? Okay. So Tarik, huh? the conqueror of Andalus is Tarik. Conqueror means the one who opens up the Spain. He opened the Spain for Muslims. That is his name, Tariq. Actually, it's Ibnu, but Aleph is dropped. And we are going to learn why the Aleph gets dropped. Okay? We will learn, brother. Now, just for your information, brother, circle Ibnu Ziyadin, circle. Now, look at it properly. Tariku. Actually, it is Tarikun. Huh? But when it gets this kind of a noun coming together, then for the comfort or for the ease of speech, we give only one Dhamma. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Hmm? Now, Tariku is marfu. She says, Sukhaina, what do you see on Ibnu? What do you see? Dhamma. Why it is Dhamma there? Why it is marfu? Nay, she says, Mamuna, you can guess? No, mashallah, mashallah. Alhamdulillah, sister. Zadikillahu ilman yas. Uh, and all of us, may Allah increase us in knowledge. Huh? That, when you have a, that kind of a situation, then Ibnu Ziyadin comes as a Naat. So Ibnu is Naat, Wahua, Mudaf, and Ziyad Mudaf. Got the idea, brother? Huh? Watch for it, it will come in our uh, study. Huh? Okay, so here, that compound, after Tariq, what is that compound? Not the way we we did, you know. Remember, uh, Alhamdulillahi, 
رب العالمین سو رب بدل مداف مداف ہی نہیں بٹ رب کیم ایز اے نات مالکی کیم ایز اے نات فائن بدل اینڈ سسٹرس اینڈ انا سن ابن مالکن سو مالکن بردر مالکا یملکو مالک اوکے رضی اللہ عنہ کال کال رسول اللہ یا تی الناسی زمانون اوکے the time will come to mankind اوکے اصابرو اوکے بدر صبر یسبرو وہو صابر so that is some file فیہم علا دینی کل قابدی what is قابدی بدر Abada Yakbidu, I beg your pardon. Inshallah, I'll double check the uh, dictionary. Sometimes, brother and sister, we got to check the dictionaries to know precisely what the Mudarya is, you know. Kabidu is the person who seizes or holds. Huh? Kabada is to hold or catch or catch, brother. So, what is the meaning of this? Jamri. Al-Jamri means piece of fire. It can be a burning coal or a piece of burning wood, brother. Uh, so, Rasul Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, the time will come uh, uh, to the people when the person who is patient with his deen, who holds on to Islam, will find it so very difficult. He has to be patient as if he is holding on to a piece of fire. If the time, tough times, and we can see these days, but the times are really very difficult in many areas. Okay. Fine, brothers and sisters. Ka'ala ta'ala, this is very important, brothers and sisters. Yuriduna an yakhruju minan nari wa ma hum بخارجين منها ولهم عذاب مقيم اوكي بان سيسس يريدون فعل مضارع مرفوع بثبوت نون where is the file al waw is your file fine بان سيسس اي يخرج ان حرف نسب وَمَسْدَرِيٍ اَنْ يَخْرُجُ فِعْلٌ مُدَارِعٌ مَنْسُوبٌ Why will you say منسوب? Because أَنْ came. منسوبٌ بِي حَذْفِ نُون Are you with me brothers and sisters? نُون آتا ہے نُون جاتا ہے In one we saw the نُون In the second the نُون is dropped. مِنَ النَّارِ Of course جَارْ مَجْرُرْ وَمَا This can be Vauhalia. Va ma, ma is, brother, what kind of ma is this? We are going to learn. Ma al-hijaziya. What is it? Ma al-hijaziya ya'malu amala laysa. So ma will have ism and ma will have khabar. So where is the ism of ma? Hum. And where is the khabar of ma? Bi kharijin. Now usually, It can have a uh, mansub form huh? or it can have a majroor form with min bi zaida. What is this? Harfu jar zaida. Are you with me? We did it. We'll do it again, inshallah. Okay. So, brothers and sisters, bi kharijina. Now, that is what we did with the analysis of the maal hijaziya. But what is kharijina? Uh, Sister Afza, what is Kharijina? Bada Samad? It's mobile, mashallah. But then we got to think. Huh? So what is this? Kharaja, Yakhruju, Wahua, Kharijun. Make it into Jama, Mudakar, Salim, Kharijun. Make it into Mansub and Majroor, Kharijina. So B came, it means it's Majroor. Are you, are you with me? Okay, brother, define it. B, Afjad. Kharijina, Majroon, Bil, Majroon, Biba. 
مجرور بھی با اوکے فائن وہ علامت جرحی الیاو بٹ دیٹس دی وی ول انالائز وی ریمبر آل دیز تھنگز ان شاء اللہ اوکے ولهم عذاب لهم جار مجرور شبو جملہ خبر مقدم ویر از دا مبتدا عذامون ان وات از مقیمون نات نو ٹیل می وات مقیمون از بدا اسم فائل فرام ویر نات کام سسٹر مو دیر از نو شدہ اکام یکیم فارم فور it is from form 4 and it is bab if'alun what is it bab if'alun okay brothers and sisters so what is mukimun a permanent place huh? so what is azabun the punishment which is permanent will last forever in huh? it will endure forever mukim and brother Al-Mukimu is the name of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Means, he is going to be there forever and ever. Huh? So, our brother Abdul Mukim, Abdul Mukim is mudaf mudafile. So, what is Al-Mukim? Akama yukimu. Wahua mukimun. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Alhamdulillah. Okay. Masrukun, brothers and sisters. Ismun. A noun, yadullu, indicate ala ma wakat alahi sarikatu. It's a noun on which, brothers and sisters, the stealing took place. Or the stealing occurred. Wahua mushtakkun, and it is derived min surika. Okay, brother, what is surika? Majhul. Now remember, Brothers and sisters, we know you cannot have ism maful from intransitive verb. Okay? And you cannot make any verb majhul if it is intransitive. Are you with me? The verb has to be transitive in order to make it into Uh, passive voice. What is passive voice? Al-fi'lul madi lil majhul. That is your passive voice. You got to keep all those English terminology in your mind. You know why, brothers and sisters? Someday you will stand up and teach our children here, and they are brought up here in Canada, so they will understand English better if you try to also bring in uh, then the the terminology of English grammar. Huh? So, ism file is called active participle. And ism maful is called passive participle. Huh? Well, you summa and it is called ism maful. Huh? Ismul mafuli, ismul masugun, min al fail il mabniyi, lil majhul, lil dalalati. Brother, dalla yadullu. And the master is Dalalatun. Alama waqa alayhi fi'alu. Same thing, brother. It indicates ma is here al-lazi. On whom the action occurred. Daraba yadribu madrubun. So what is madrubun? It's the noun on which the action took place of beating. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? So mafulun means it is the receiver of the action. Are you with me? For akala. Uh, akilun and maakulun. What is the meaning of maakulun? The thing which is eaten. The, which receives the action of eating. I try to, you know, explain you in a very simple way. Inshallah, it makes sense. Huh? But the shariba yashrabu wahuwa sharibun and mashrubun means The things which receive the action of being drunk. Okay. Got the idea, inshallah? Okay. Wa huwa ala wazni. Wa huwa ala wazni. Maf'oolun. Are you with me? 
Remember this version, maf u lun. Where is fa kalima? Fa. Where is ain kalima? Ain. And lam kalima. But remember fa kalima got a sukun. And ain kalima also got extra wow there. Huh? So what is extra in maf u lun? Meme and wow. This is extra. But that is the pattern. Huh? It's very easy. Once you understand these things, brother, you will be surprised how beautiful and fascinating Arabic language is, you know, and how, how easy and in, interesting it becomes, inshallah. Min fail sulasi, brother, mujarrad. What is mujarrad? When you say fail sulasi, mujarrad. I say mujarrad, not mujarrid. So, Sister Maimuna, what is mujarrad? It is ism maful. What is the verb? Jarrada. Huh? What is the verb, brothers and sisters? Jarrada. You jarridu. Mujarrid will be ism file, and mujarrad is ism maful. Huh? Are you with me? So, that is your. Fail sulasi mazid fihi. What is it? Fail sulasi mazid fihi. When you say fail sulasi, mujarrad means pure. Huh? There is nothing added to it. Huh? It is in its pure form. Nothing has been added to it. They can also say naked. Okay, fine, brothers and sisters. So this maf'ul, brothers and sisters, this maf'ul, is that applies to fail sulasi mujarrat huh? applies to fail sulasi mujarrat fine is takhraj min darsi asma maf'ulin al waridati fihi wa azkur ma kulli wahidin minha fi'l mushtaqu minhu ala nahu ta'ali but we have already done it didn't we do it you were careful in highlighting when we read the lesson. Now if you get time, write it down on a piece of paper. What will you write down? It's some file, it's some maful. So you, if you get a chance, write down on a piece of paper all the some file from the main lesson. Huh? And you'll write down the some file, then you'll write down the verb, madi mudarya. And the same way you will write down some maful and write down the verb, madi mudarya. Now, in the dars, in the main dars, Dr. Sahib uses majhul to make ism maf'ul. Are you with me? I want you to quickly look to the key. Huh? Page 27, footnote. Number 3. The ism maf'ul is derived from the passive form of the verb. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Huh? Okay. That is why the passive form of the verb is given in the main book. But here in the key, the active form is given as it is easier to understand. So do not get confused, brother Muhammad. In the main dars, passive form is given. I think there is a logic in giving the passive forms. You know why? If the verb does not have a passive form, it does not have. <laughs> it's a maful. You got the idea? If the verb cannot have a passive form, then there will be no it's a maful in that way. So it's very logical. But it is for us sometimes easier to take the it's a maful directly from the active voice, inshallah. Fine, brother. Number six. Sug. What is the meaning of sug? Form. Form. Asmal maf'u lina min al afwal al atiyati. Al fiel and then is a maf'ul. Now, as you can see, the passive form of the verb is given. Kutila. Huh? Give, give, give the mudari also. For practice. Kutila yuktalu. Huh? You got to write it. Huh? 
Kotila Yukatalu for our extra practice, brother. And what Hua Hua Maktu brother. Ulima Yulamu. Ulima Yulamu. Hua Hua Malum, brother. Malum do din ke liye mehman yaha. Malum nahi manzil hai kaha. So malum is very common in Urdu. But it is actually Arabic and it is ism maf'ul. So ila yus alu. Mas'ulun. How will you write down mas'ulun? Write it down properly, brother. Mas u like this, huh? Mas ulun. Okay, the person responsible who is being asked huh, has to answer. He is a responsible person in charge. Mas ul means person who is in charge. Huh? He can be the guardian, can be the manager. Fine, brother. Shuriba. Yushrabu, huh? write down the majul form so we get extra practice. And huwa mash, mashrubun, mashrubun. Huh? Now, brother, kuriya, see how the kuriya is written. Huh? Kara'a, huh? I will write it down, brother and sisters. Huh? I will write it down. Kara'a. So here, Hamza got a chair of Aleph. Now it will become Kuri. Now there is a Kasra. So Hamza will get a chair of Ya. But no dots. Don't put dots here, brothers and sisters. Kuriya. Okay, brothers and sisters. What is the meaning of Kara'a? He read. What is the meaning of Kuriya? It was read. Huh? Are you with me? It was red. Huh? Fine. And what will be? Kuriya Yuk Ra'u. Yuk Ra'u. And what will be Isam Maful? Makru'un. Makru'un. This is how will you write down, brother? Mak. Ru'un. Now, brothers and sisters, you know you have with you, we recommended to you the dictionary of verb conjugation. In that dictionary, ism file, ism maf'ul are all given. So anytime you have any doubt, you can go back and check the spellings, inshallah. That book is very handy. I always say that book is worth its weight in gold. Okay. Inshallah, we'll move forward. Wujida, you jadu vow will come out. And what is this maful? Maujud. This is very common, maujud, present, found. Okay. Kusira, yuk saru, and then comes maksurun. Al kalamu, maksurun. Fine. Wulida, you ladu, vow will come out. Huh? You will do, wow will come out. You know why? Because it is mithal. Okay? And what will be the ism maful? Maulu. Okay? Fine. Kuriha. Yukrahu. Makruhun. Ukila. Yukalu. Makulun. Makulun. Dufina. Yud. Fanu. And then. Madfu nun means buried, huh? buried. Huh? Gusila yugsalu magsurun, something which is being washed. Acha. Holika yuch laku. Get used to the passive voice. Yuch huh? laku, and then makhlu. Fine, brothers and sisters. Fusila, yuf salu, and then mafsulun. What is the meaning of mafsulun? Discharge. Dismissed. One more. Fired. Ayin asma fa'ilina 
wa asma'a maf'ulina fi ma'yali. Okay, but that, da, what is da? Da. What is da? Put. Wada yada'u da. Put. Khattan wahidan tahta al-ula wa khattayni tahta thaniya. So, ism file, you'll put one uh, one line, and ism maful, you will put two lines. Or if you have two highlighters, reserve one highlighter for ism file and one highlighter for ism maful, but don't get mixed up, brother. Uh, don't get mixed up. The color should be consistent. Uh, fine, brother. Call al mudiru lit talibaini. Man min kumut daribu wa manil madrubun. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? How many isam files are there and isam mafuls are there? Two? Are you sure? What is the first one? Mashallah, mashallah, talibaini. What is the verb? Talaba yatulubu wa huwa. Talibun and from Talibun Talibani and from Talibani Talibaini. Huh? Are you Alhamdulillah? Okay. Daribu, Daraba Yadribu wa huwa Daribun and Madrubun. Isam Mafud. Huh? Are you with me, brother? The two students are in front of the headmaster and is asking them, who amongst you is the beat, <laughs> and who got beaten? <laughs> okay, what the farra? What is the meaning of farra? Farar ho gaya, baag gaya, he ran away. Farra means to run away. But huh? right down by side of farra, it is farira. What is it? Farira, bab samia. Not Farida. <laughs> Farida. <laughs> okay, brother. Farrar Katilu. What is the translation? The murderer ran away. Ran away. Wa nukila nakala nukila. What is the meaning of nukila? To transport somebody. Maktul huh? was transported. Ilal Mustashfa. I mean, Maktul is the person who was killed was uh, sent to hospital. Kabadana means to catch. Brothers and sisters, Kabadana means to catch. Alasariku. So Kabada will always be followed by Allah. Huh? Kabadana alasarik means, brothers and sisters, we caught the thief. Huh? But we lam najid. We did not find ladaihi in in the who ladaihi in the who al mal al masruka the stolen thing we did not find. We caught him, but the things that he stole we could not find. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Very good. Adhan al Masjid al Nabawi Masmu'un. Translation, brother. The Adhan of Masjid al Nabawi is heard. Huh? Is heard. Fi Jamahi Ahyail Madinatil Munawarati. In every Mardina Munawara. In every region, every part of Madina Munawara. Okay, brothers and sisters. Kultuli Bakkali, I said to the Bakkal, I said to the grocer, Ayu Jadu Ladaika Dajajun Madbuhun. What is the translation, brother? In fact, in English we'll say, Do you have any slaughtered chickens? Huh? Do you have any slaughtered chicken? Now, I want to analyze it, brother. Ah, what is ah? Harfu istifam. What is it? Harfu. Yujadu. What is yujadu? 
فعل مدار للمجہول مرفون و علامت رفع ہی دمت ظاہر فائن بدن سسٹرس ویر از دل آئی سے فائل نو وے بیکاز اٹ از اٹ از پیس وائس مجہول سو آئی ول ہیو ٹو فائن نائ فائل ویر از نائ فائل دجا جن ماشاء اللہ بیکاز نائ فائل ہیز ٹو بی مرفو سو ویر ڈو یو آئی فائن دجا جن آر یو ودی ودن سسٹر دیٹ از یور نائ فائل اینڈ واٹ از مذبو ہن از اے مفول فائن بٹ واٹ از اٹ سسٹر مہمونا نات اٹ از نات اوکے فائن ودن سسٹرس لدئی کا ظرف مداف الہی نو بدر اینڈ سسٹرس دس از ہاؤ وجد یجیدو وجیدا یو جدو از یوز اوکے سو یو آس یو جدو این دا کا اینڈ دین واٹ ایور یو آر لوکنگ فار اٹ بٹ ان انگلش واٹ ہاؤ ڈو وی سی ان انگلش وی سی ان انگلش ڈو یو ہیو از وتھ یو دیز تھنگس آر دیز تھنگس فاؤنڈ وتھ یو But we don't say that. We say, do you have, you know, inshallah. You got the idea, brothers and sisters? How the talibu mafsulun. Okay, brother. What is hadha? Muftada. What is talib? Badan. And what is mafsulun? Khabar. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? What do we have here? Talib, ism file, and mafsul. اس مفول مفصول دس اسٹوڈنٹ از ڈسمسڈ دس اسٹوڈنٹ از فائرڈ از ریموڈ فائن بدر سسٹر لا تا تا لل مخلوق فی ما سیت الخالقی اوکے بدر ہاؤ مینی ورڈز آر وی لوکنگ ان دس سینٹینس مخلو مخلوق سو واٹ از مخلوق اس مفول خالا کا یا لکھو اوکے اور خولی کا یو خلکو ان شاء اللہ وی ول تھنک دیٹ وے آلسو ان شاء اللہ اوکے مخلوق از دا اس مفول خالق خالا کا یا خلکو فائن بدن سس آئی ڈیڈ ایکسپلین یو ان ڈیٹیل دس از سچ اے بیوٹیفل بیوٹیفل ایکسپریشن ان عربک لینگویج لا تا وٹ از دس لا لا انافیت لل جنس آئی ایم ہوپنگ ویل لرن دس سون بیکاز دس از سچ اے بیوٹیفل بیوٹیفل ایکسپریشن بردر وین یو سی لا الا بردر یو کین ناٹ ٹرانسلیٹ دس یو گاٹ ٹو انڈرسٹینڈ ان عربک اینڈ اف یو سی لا الا دیر از نو گاڈ بٹ گاڈ That is the poorest of poor translation. Okay. The most suitable translation will be no, nobody deserves to be worshipped. Nobody is entitled to be worshipped. Nobody has a right to be worshipped except Allah. Well, so we are going to study this inshallah. So here it comes to La Ta'ata. Ta'ata means obedience. Absolutely in the category of obedience, there is no obedience to the one who is created, anyone who is in this universe created, there is no obedience to him if it amounts to disobeying Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. If there is Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's command in Quran, that's what has to be obeyed. Nothing else. Okay, so it's a very powerful sentence. Inshallah, we'll uh, study it further later on. Huh? Aza, are you hungry, brothers and sisters? Aza, baidun, maslukun. What is maslukun? Boiled. All you need is salt and pepper now. <laughs> maslukun is brother. Boiled, okay. Salaka yasluku. Salaka yasluku. Salaka means to boil. To cook in 
boiling water. Okay. And Abdullah ibn Umar ra, radiallahu anhuma kaala. Uh, so there are two ashabis, Abdullah and Umar. So anhuma kaala. Akhaza Rasulullahi bi mankibi. Brother, mankibun. What is mankibun? Shoulder. What is monkey boom? Shoulder. Okay. So, Rasul Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam grabbed the shoulder. Fakala. Uh, and he said, Kun. What is Kun, brother? Amar. Kana yakunu. Kun. Fellow Amrin. Mabnun ala sukun. Kun fit dunya. Be in this world. Be in the world. Kaanna ka. Gharibun. What is the meaning of Gharibun, brother? Stranger. Not poor man. Stranger. Garib means stranger. As if you are a stranger. Huh? Okay. Au abiru. Abara, uh, brother and sisters, is to cross. To cross something. Huh? Abiru sabili. As if you are passing, huh, brother, in the way. You are passing the path. Are you with me? Be in the dunya as if you are a stranger. This place does not belong to you. Your home is somewhere else or you are just passerby. Are you with me? You are just passing the, this way you are. Okay. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? So, Abiru is your ism file. Huh? I think it is Abara Yaburu. But if I make an error... Please forgive me. We can always check the dictionary. Kaala Taala, Inna Allah Falikul Habbi Wal Nawa. Falaka is to break apart. Huh? Okay, brother. Let us analyze this quickly. Inna Harfu Taqid Wa Naspin. Allah Lafzul Jalalati. Huh? Ismu inna mansubun. Where is khabar inna? Faliku. Wa huwa mudaf. And where is mudaf ilayhi? Habbi. What is the meaning of habbi? Grain. Grain. And what is nava? This is the seed of date. Okay. The stone, the pit. Okay. Let me write down here. Brother. Write down, brother. Nawatun. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? This is singular. And what is plural? Navan. What is plural? Navan. And when you put Navan with Alif Lam, it will become An Nava. Are you with me? I'll put that also, brother. You make it with an nava, like that. Huh? Okay, brothers and sisters. Taamal ma yali, ishtara, yashtari, ishtari. Now, brothers and sisters. We did a little bit of practice, but in book two, we avoided to conjugate this properly. Are we ready to conjugate it now? Inshallah. Let's practice, brother. Ishtara, Ishtaraya, Ishtarau, Ishtarat, Ishtarata, Ishtaraina, Ishtaraita, Ishtaraituma, Ishtaraitum, Ishtaraiti, Ishtaraituma, Ishtaraitunna, Ishtaraitu, Ishtaraina. Huh? Okay. Ana Ishtaraitu. Nahnu Ishtaraina. Anta Ishtaraita. Hum Ishtarau. Hum Ishtarau. Huh? Okay. Hum Ishtarau. An Nasu Ishtarau. Huh? An Nisau Ishtaraina. Are you with me? Huh? Muhammadun Ishtara. 
Amina to Ishtarat. Are you with me? Inshallah, remember. Okay, brother and sister, Yashtari. Very beautiful verb, brother, because it's so common. And I think we can handle it now with confidence. Yashtari, Yashtariyani, Yashtaruna. Because Kasra will change into Dhamma in order to be compatible with Vaw. One more time. Yashtari, Yashtariyani, Yashtaruna, Tashtari, Tashtariyani, Yashtarina, Anta, Tashtari, Tashtariyani, Antum, Tashtaruna, Anti, Tashtarina, Tashtariyani, Antunna, Tashtarina, Ana, Ashtari, Nahnu, Nashtari. Now when you will make it Majzum, you will drop the Harfu Illa. But when you will make it mansub, you will give fata on ya. Are you with me? This rule has to be remembered, brother. So, ishtara. How will I define ishtara? Fialun madin mabniun ala patahatin mukaddaratin. Brothers and sisters, you got to be careful, huh? Okay, brothers and sisters, I wrote down Ishtara, watch it. Fail, Mahdin, Mabniun ala, Fatahatin, Mukaddaratin, Yashtari, Failun, Mudariun, Marfuun, Wa alamatu Rafaihi, Dammatun, Mukaddara. Remember this, brother. Sometimes we will be able to analyze it in a very, very nice way, in a, in a very perfect way, inshallah. And then ishtari, how will you define ishtari? Fialu amrin mabni nala hazafi harfi illa. Very good, brother and sister. Become ishtaraita. Now, you must remember ishtara, the hamza of ishtara is hamzatul wasal. So anything that comes in front of it, we won't pronounce the Hamza. So watch this brother sentence. Bika mishtaraita. Bika mishtaraita. Hadihi sa'ata. What is hazihi? Mafulun bihi. And what is sa'ata? Badal. Very good. Maza turidu an tashta ri ya. Maza turidu an tashtariya fil maktabati in the store, okay? I will just try to remind you whether turidu fialun mudariun marfun bi dhamma fail mustatir takdiruhu anta an harfu nasmin wa masdariyin tashtariya Fialun mudariyun mansubun wa alamatu nasbihi al-fatahatu zahira. Fine. Okay. Fialun mustatirun taqdiruhu anta. And then what will I say? Anta shtariya al-mastar al-mu'awwal fi mahalli nasbin mafulun bihi. Inshallah, we will remember it. You have done this in book two, but just to refresh you, huh? Sir so Nasreen, it will come back. I will be repeating this over and over again, inshallah. Huh? So that you will get a good practice, brother. That is why I always request you, you know, unless it's an emergency, do not miss the class. Because by coming here and listening to the teacher for nearly two and a half hours, it makes you strong. And these Terms, you know, are no longer uh, strange to us, you know. La huh? tashtari, what is this la? La annahiya. Tashtari, failun mudariyun majzumun wa alamatu jazmihi alfu harfi illa. Masha. Hada muajjama, what is haza? Mafulun bihi, what is al muajjama? Badal. Ishtari. Now this is fi'al amar. 
इश्तारी फेलो अमरिन मबनी मबनी हजफी हरफी अल्लाह जाका जाका जालिका वट इज जालिका मफोलन भी ही परचेज दैट फाइन न हो आसन हो बिकॉज इट इज बेटर ओके फाइन बेटर काल ताला इन अल्लाह हस्तरा मिन अल मोमिनीना अनफुसहुम ओके वो अमवालहुम भी अन्न लहुम जन्ना ता बेटर ओके आई आई वांट टू एनालाइज बेटर here brother this ishtara the scholar say istimalun majaziyun it does not mean literal meaning it's a symbolic meaning what is the, it is symbolic meaning okay inshallah you'll remember that ha huh, brother maybe some day uh, you know we can also discuss this uh, in uh, حرف توكيد ونسب الله لفظ جلالتي وي اولويز سي لفظ جلالتي اسمه ان منسوب او بدا فيريس خبر ان الجمله الفعليه سو وي ويل فرست ستارت ذا فعل نو ات از اشترى فعل ماد مبني على فتحه مقدره ओके वेर इज द फाइल मुस्तर तकदीर हुआ या दुल्लु अल्लाह अल्लाह फाइन बदर मिनल मोमिनी जार मजरूर ओके वट इज मोमिनी इसम मजरूर वह अलामत जर्री अल जाओ ली अन्ना हु जमा मुजाकर सालम बदर अन फुसहुम वट इज दिस अन फुसहुम अन What kind of a combination is this? Mudaf, mudafili. What is anfusa? Anfusa, anfusa, mafulun bihi. What is it, brother? Nafsun an anfu sun. So anfusa is mafulun bihi for the fiel ishtara. Are you with me, brother? Mafulun. Wahua mudaf, and then hum. मुदाफे वाव हरफु अतफिन अमवाल मातुफुन अला अनफुसा हाँ ओके वह हुआ मुदाफ एंड हुम मिदाफे बी हरफ चार अन्ना बदल अन्ना इस में नखवातु इन्ना ओके इट इस आल्सो हरफु ताकीद व नस्प बदल ओके बदल इंसिस्टर लुक एट इट अन्ना हैज कम हाँ We have to have ismu anna and khabar anna. So anna lahum. What is lahum? Jar majur, shibu jumla, khabar anna. Lahum cannot be ismu anna. Lahum cannot be ismu anna. So what is ismu anna? Is it mansub? Yeah. See, you see, it is mansub. Huh? So that is your ismana. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Okay. Here, bi anna lahum. Write down this. Huh? Lahum meaning of lahum. Yani means meaning. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Meaning, their reward is jannah. Jazau who means their reward, and what is their reward? Jannah. That is the meaning of lahum huh? jannah. Huh? Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Okay, we have number nine, but I guess before we start, we will. Take a break and recharge our batteries, inshallah. I am sure there are, there is some energizing uh, snacks, the snacks which will energize you. Oh, sister Arifa, Jazakallah, sister Arifa, she has brought baklava. 
Because she knew this lesson is like a baklava. So she brought some baklava. Okay, let us enjoy, brother. And as usual, my advice to you is, you want to enjoy your tea? Then don't talk. It will taste more delicious. Brothers and sisters, we are back. Hope you enjoyed the baklava. We must all thank Sister Arifa. Jazakillahu, Sister Arifa. May Allah bless you and your family uh, for your generosity in treating uh, the class with baklava. Truly speaking, it is an energizing <laughs> snack. <laughs> Alhamdulillah. We'll start. Brother. Number nine. Ma ana bi gafi lin. So, brother, what kind of a sentence is this? Hadhi ma ana fiatu. Are you with me? Wahiya min akhwatu laisa. Tadkhulu ala jumla til ismiyati. It enters jumla ismiya. Fatarfau al ism, and it makes the ism. Marfu. Tarfau means it makes the ism marfu. Wan tansibu al khabar. And it makes the khabar mansu. Wa tusamma and it is called ma al hijaziyatu. Tusamma is majul, it is called ma al hijaziyatu. Nahu. Ma haza basharan. This is ayah from Surah Yusuf. Okay. Ma, how will you describe ma? Ma. Al Hijaziyatu. Mabniun ala Sukun. Mabniun ala Sukun. Alhamdulillah. And what will you say? Haza? Ismu ma al Hijaziya. Okay, but brother, we will describe Haza. How will you describe Haza? Ismu Ishara. Mabniun ala Sukun. Fi mahalli Rafa'in. Uh, ismu ma al hijaziya. Uh, very good. Basharan, khabarun, mansubun. Uh, khabarun, ma hijaziya, mansubun. Fine. Brother. Wa qad. Brother, when the qad comes, when the qad comes with fail mudariya, what does it mean? Maybe. What does it mean? It is possible. Remember, when the qad comes with fi'al madi, it is definite. Uh, then it becomes harfu tahqiq. But when it comes with fi'al mudariya, then the translation is, it's possible. Or it's, it may be, uh, yaktarinu. What is yaktarinu? Iktarana yaktarinu. Form, form 8. Uh, what is the meaning of yaktarinu? To attach or to connect. Huh? It is joined or coupled. Huh? Iktarana means to get connected. Okay. Where is the file of Yaktarinu? Khabaru. See, Marfu. Uh, means the khabar of it can be connected. Belbai. Zaidati by extra. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? And there are beautiful examples in the Quran. Huh? Fine. Mallahu, this is an example from Quran. Mallahu bigafilin. Huh? Okay. So what is Allahu, brother? Lafzul Jalalati. Huh? Ismun Ma al Hijazia. Huh? And bigafilin Jar Majrur. Okay. Huh? What will I say? Majroorun lafzan. Are you with me? Majroorun lafzan. Mansubun mahlan. Khabaru ma al hijaziya. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? But Hassan, did you get it? No, I said, Pigafilin, it's majroor. Majroorun lafzan. Huh? But mahlan, it's mansub. Because the khabar of ma hijaziya is always. Mansu, huh? like Mahada Basharan. You can change that also. Mahada Bi Basharin. Huh? So there is a possibility. It can be uh, with Bi Harfchar. It will come be like this. Mallahu Bi Gafilin. Remove Bi. What will you say? Mallahu 
gafilan malla mallahu gafilan huh? okay right amma ta'maluna with what you are doing okay huh? ikral misal read the example thum adkhil what is adkhil brother okay what kind of a fail is this form for mashallah you got to remember huh hamzatul qata huh when you see hamzatul qata it should strike us what is this what is the verb adkhala yudkhilu yudkhilu huh? and from there amar is adkhil means you bring something inside huh adkhil ma hijaziyata ala al jumlat al atiyati brothers and sisters anta mujtahidun mubtada khabar ma anta mujtahidan brother what is ma al hijaziyah what is anta ismu ma al hijaziyah marfun and what is mujtahidan khabaru ma al hijaziyah mansubun fine brother what is the other style of writing it ma anta bi mujtahidin are you with me brother and sister bi mujtahidin mashallah mashallah huh? so bi mujtahidin is jar majrur huh? and it is majrurun lafzan wa mansubun mahlan huh? inshallah you'll remember ana kariyun mubtada khabar okay ma ana kariyan or you will say ma ana bi kari and you write it down na brothers and sisters you will write it down nahnu tujarun mubtada khabar ma nahnu tujaran ma nahnu bi tujarin got the idea brothers and sisters inshallah huwa qaribun ma huwa qariban or ma huwa bi qariban mashallah mashallah Uh, fits the baklava that we ate. Huh? <laughs> This exercise fits beautifully with the baklava. Hati mudariya, rafal alatiya, kafala yakfulu. What is the meaning of kafala? To guarantee something, or to sponsor, or to be responsible, or to be liable. Huh? Okay, kafala. Yagafulu, also Bab Nasara. Okay. What is the meaning of gafala? To be heedless, huh? unmindful, huh? inattentive. Fine, brother. Sister. Falaka yafliku means to break it apart. Asifa to be sorry. Ya, ya safu ba fatah. Huh? Fine. Nahara. to scold yanharu ha huh? abara ya buru ya buru bab nasara ha huh? to cross through okay brothers and sisters warada yaridu ha huh? warada yaridu okay means to mention okay brothers and sisters farra ya fir brothers and sisters I, i i think i made a mistake No, brother. I think I made a mistake. You got to correct it. Huh? I asked you to write farra, farira. That is not right. Farra is farara. Can you can you rewrite it again, please? Huh? In the main lesson, farra is farara. I said farira. That is not correct. Because if it is farira, then it should have been ya farru. But it is ya firru. It means it's bab daraba. So it is farara yaf riru. Are you with me? Farara yafiru yafiru. So this is bab daraba. So farara. Did you make correction? Okay, brothers and sisters. And then sabaka yas biku. Huh? To proceed. Huh? Happened before. be earlier than or to come before or to proceed huh? 
Sabaka, yes, biku. Okay. And then salaka, yes, luku. Huh? To boil, cook in boiling water. Fine, brother and sister. Hati jama. And a smile at yati. Yatimun yatama. Huh? You know how to write yatama, inshallah? Huh? Or aitamun. Okay, brothers and sisters, I will write down. Yatama or aitamun. These are the two plurals of yatim. Okay. Now, brothers and sisters, Kuflun, Akfalun, Jihatun, Jihatun. Jihatun means from direction, from side. Jihatun, Jihatun. Brother Abidun, what is Abidun? Abidun. Okay, or Ubadun. Abidun. Abidun or Ubadun. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Now remember, they can have these. One word can have many plural forms. Okay, brothers and sisters. Next page, you have a palm showing five fingers. And the names are given here. What will you say to the finger in Arabic? Isba'un. What is it? Isba'un. Huh? And what will be the plural? It is on the wazan of mafailu. Asabi'u. Okay, asabi. That is your plural, huh, brother. Write down this also, brother. How will you translate? And to. <laughs> what will you call to? Isbaul Kadami. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Finger and to. Also write down one more thing, brother. Very nice noun, brother. What will you write down, brother? A rahatu means palm. Huh? Inshallah. Brothers and sisters, we'll start lesson number five. It is continuation of lesson number four. Okay. But I would like to read the key so that, inshallah, we get some good idea. Again, I must remind you. Read the key of book three as often as it is possible. Before you come to the class, if you get an opportunity, read the key. Huh? Because it will make you understand that's better. Brother. In this lesson, we learn the following. We have learned the formation of the passive voice from the Salim verbs. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? From the Salim verbs. Huh? No verb with wow and yeah. Hmm? Now we learn its formation from the ajwaf. We are only talking about ajwaf. We are not talking about nakis. Huh? Ajwaf. Kala will become kela. Okay. And ba'a will become bia. So there is only one form. No matter what kind of ajwaf it is. If it is ajwaf yai or wavi. Uh, whether it is Bab Daraba or Nasara or Bab Samiya. Remember, Kala 
yakulu bab nasara ba yabiu bab daraba nama yanamu bab samia whatever the bab is if it is to be made majhul and if it is transitive then the form will be okay brothers and sisters kind of a kala kila ba bi zada zida huh? with ya brothers and sisters okay will you remember this brothers and sisters inshallah there is no need to conjugate there is no need to conjugate the whole thing you know because you won't be using them huh? now if i say to you what did i write down brothers and sisters qilali what is the meaning of it it was told to me huh? i was told same thing qilali means it has been told to me or in other words i was said it was it was said to me or i was told huh? okay fine now how do i say it was said to them kila lahu that's it huh? what will you say kila it was said to you kila laka it was said to you monnas kila laki it was said to us or we were told kila lana so it's very simple huh inshallah do not you know think that this will create difficulties it's very simple brother so qila and bia and zida all these things brother will be on this pattern okay now i have to tell you something brother kala became kila okay and then kala became ya ku lu now i want you to think when i made mudariya what will be the alamat on mudariya you are you with me you okay now remember huh, that it is ain kalima gets a fata huh? so where is ain kalima wow so if it gets fata okay then it changes it becomes okay now this wow will change into alif are you with me brothers and sisters one can go still deeper into it but we don't want to go any more deeper kala yakulu kila you call huh? huh? it was said it is said huh? brother abdul samad it is said fine brother now ba he sold yabiu he sells huh? now let us make it majhul b Uh, uh, you ba u same uh, you ba u uh, so it's easy brother you ba u now i do one more brother za da yazidu and then it will become zida Uh, then it will become you yuzad got the idea uh, okay so this is it brother let's see what more it is written qala becomes qila it was said ba becomes bia it was sold zada becomes zida it was increased uh, okay 
Yakulu becomes Yukalu, it is said. Yabiu becomes Yubau, it is sold. And Yazidu becomes Yuzadu, it is increased. Do you understand, brothers and sisters? So, no matter in the active voice, whatever the Bab is, but in passive voice, the forms are simpler. Qila, Bia, Zida, and Yukalu, Yubau, Yuzadu. It's very simple. One simple form to keep it in mind, inshallah. Okay? Brothers and sisters, here is some example. Yukalu. What is the meaning of Yukalu? It is said. Huh? In Hadhil Arda, that this land, piece of land, you can say, huh? be at. Why be at? Because the, the knife file is Muannas. Arda is your knife file, it is Muannas. Huh? Be million realin. It is said that this land was sold, be at, was sold for million real. Now you will read a sign outside a store. Hona tubau suhufa wa majallatu. Brothers and sisters, what is tubau? Felon mudarion marfun lil majhul. Are you with me? Lil majhul marfun wa alamatu rafi adamma. Ozahira file. And where is the knife file? Suhufu. Now suhufu, brother and sister. Kullu jama mu'anas. So it is a jama. So we treat it as a mu'anas. So instead of yubau, we say tubau. Got the idea? Why do we say tubau and not yubau? Because the knife file is mu'anas. We treat it as a mu'anas. Kullu jama mu'anas. So hoof is newspapers. Okay? Wal majallatu. What will be majallatu? What is majallatu? Mautufun ala suhufu. That will be our correct explanation. Fine, brothers and sisters. Okay. We have learned in our previous lesson the formation of ism file from salim verbs. Now we learn its formation from non salim. Brother, okay, fine. Brother, we did brush through this in our book too. So it, we'll go through it quickly. But the Hajja, Hajja, break it down, brother. Hajaja, make it some file from Hajaja. Hajijun, huh? Hajijun, are you with me, brother and sisters? Hajijun, ha, ji, jun. Okay. So remember, ain kalima, lam kalima are same. So what happens? The ain kalima loses its vowel sign. And gets a sukun. So what will you now pronounce as? How will you pronounce now, brothers and sisters? Hajun. Actually it is Hajijun. Are you with me? Dalla. What is it? He went astray. He went astray. Dalla. If you make Isam file, how will you make it? Oh. Dalilun. What is it? Oh. Dalilun. Dalilun. Okay, brothers and sisters. Now, Ain Kalima, Lam Kalima are same. So, Ain Kalima loses its vowel signs. So we give sukun. So what happens now? Da lun. Huh? It happens now? Da lun with shadda. Okay? And da lun is singular. Make it plural. Da lun. Da lun. Jama mudakar salam. Make it mansub. Dalina. Make it majroor. Yeah. 
اهتنا الشراط المستقيم شراط الذين أنعمت عليهم غير مغضوب عليهم ولا دالين so what is this دالين it's مجرور uh, and what is the مرفو form دالون what is the singular دالون got the idea about that so even every noun in Quran inshallah we will be able to figure out so when you say Dalina, sister Mamuna, what is Dalina? It is Jama Mudakar Salim. It's marf, man, Majroor. So what is the Marfu forms? Dalun. And what is the singular? Dalun. How was it made? From Ism Fail, Failun, and the verb is Dalla. What is the verb? Dalla. From Dalla, it became Dalun. Got the idea? We will be able to figure out, inshallah. Most of the time. Huh? Most of the time, inshallah. No, brother. Kala yakulu ta'ilun. Ba'a yabiu ba'ilun. Zaka yaduku za'ikun. You know that, huh? We did it in book two. Remember? Brother Hassan? Kala yakulu ta'ilun. So the wasn't now. Uh, instead of fa ilun, if it is ajwaf, it becomes fa ilun. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Sister Sumaya, uh, this is in ajwaf. Remember, in ajwaf, we don't have ain, but it is hamza. Uh, so kala will become ka ilun, ba'a will become. Bayun. Zaka will become Zaikun. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Okay. And Zada will become Zaidun. Huh? Okay. Now, brother Nakis, I think you remember. Masha Yamshi. What will be? Mashin Kada Yakadi. Kadin. Are you with me? We know that, huh? I'm not going in detail now. We did it. <laughs> MashaAllah, Alhamdulillah, we did it very well then. So here is Naja Yanju. Najin, the one who escapes the disaster. Huh? Originally it is Naji Wun. Huh? And also originally Zada Yazidu is Zayi Dun, but it becomes Zai Dun. Huh? And Naji Wun also will become Najin. Hmm? Okay. Saka Yaski Sakin. We know that very well, Alhamdulillah. And when you bring Mankus and make it definite, then the Ya will become visible. Are you with me, brother? Sakin will become Asa Kri with Ya. Huh? And Najin will become Anna. G with ya. The next one is ism maf'ool. Huh? Remember maf'oolun, but that is only when it is salim. What happens when they are nakis? We have learned in the previous lesson the formation of ismul maf'ooli from the salim word. Now we learn its formation from non salim. Okay? The mudaf verb. The ism maful from this verb is regular. There is no difficulty here. Okay. Sarra. So what is actually sarra? Sarira. But how many words are there? Sa, ra, ra. Put now ism maful. Mas, ru, run. Are you with me? Write down, brother. Sar, ra. Which is actually sa ri ra. Now, first will come ma. Okay? And then maf. So it will become mas. Ul. U. So it will become ru. And then lun. It will become. See how it, easy it is? Mas ru run. Sa ri ra. Mas ru Run. Very easy, brothers and sisters. Next one, brothers and sisters. 
Adha. What is Adhada? So then, Ma'adud. Remember? Al-Adad, well, Ma'adud. Thing counted. Huh? It's a maful. Sabba Masbubun. Okay. Halla Mahlulun. Is it clear, brothers and sisters? Inshallah, you will read it and it will become very, very easy on you. Very, very easy on you, inshallah. Okay. Now comes a little difficult part, brother. Slightly difficult. Kala Yakulu. And it will become Makulu. It should have been. Brother, what is Kala? It is Kavala. Are you with me? From Kavala, if I take my formula, the pattern, Mafaulun, it will become. Makwulun. But we don't say makwulun, we say makulun. What do we say? What is the meaning of makulun? The thing which is said. Huh? The thing which is said. So it is makul. Should I have been makwulu, but that's the way we use it makulu now. Fine? Now comes ba. Which is actually ba ya a. Okay, but that original. Mab maf olun. Keep that thing in your mind. Maf olun. So what will be? Mab yu on. But it changes in tune. Mabi on. What does it change in tune? Ma, be, on. This is your ism mafol. Now I, brother, this is interesting. Zada. Huh? What is zada? Za, ya, da. Make ism mafol. Maz, you, dun. Correct? What is it, brother? Maz Yu Dun And we change that into Mazidun huh? Okay Ma Zi Dun One more I'll do brother Now these were all Ajwaf Now I do Bana huh? What is actually Banaya, huh? Banaya. Okay, brother. Make mafulun. Mab nuyun. First, we go to the original. Mafulun. So it becomes mab nu. Yun. Then that wow changes into ya and then other changes take place. So what will be now? Mabuni yun. Are you with me, brother and sister? Mabuni yun. So these are the things you'll keep it in mind. And the more we read, the more easy you will find that you can make it, you can understand it without any difficulty, inshallah. As I said many times, brothers and sisters, when the new concept comes for the first time, we feel overwhelmed. Huh? It becomes a little bit too much. But next day, it becomes easier. And on third day, it will become even more easier. And after one week, what will you say? I knew it from the, my childhood. You know, It will become so easy for you. Okay, brothers and sisters. Okay, the ismul fail from this verb is regular. Sarra is masroorun. Adda maadudun. We did that, brother. La yakulu. Okay, brother. Here is more example. Lama yalumu. What will be ism maful? Malumun. Brother, lama is to blame. And what will be ism file? Laimun. The one who blames. 
And yes, yeah. And uh, uh, some uh, manas. What will be some maful? Malumun means blameworthy. You put blame on somebody. It comes all the time, brother. It comes at many places in Quran. Malumun. Huh? What is malumun? Ism maful. Yeah. It is ism maful. But the ya zada yazidu mazidun. So originally it is maz yudun. Okay, brothers and sisters. The second radical has been dropped and the vow of maful has been changed into ya. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Here are some more examples. Kala yakilu makilun. Originally makyulun. What I request, brother. Always keep the pattern mafa'ulun in your mind. Huh? But when it comes to ajwaf and nakis, there is some change. Are you with me? There is some change. Okay. Now, this is very nice. Da'a yada'ul. Da'a yada'ul, brothers and sisters. So, how many things are there? Da'a is... Uh, I want to finish if you... If you let me, brother and sister, I hope you won't mind. And then we'll start fresh tomorrow. The A is? The A. Now, Maf'oolun. Brother Muhammad. Mad. Oolun. Now remember, this vow is the Lam Kalima. This is your Ain Kalima. And this is your? Fa kalima. This vav is extra. Are you with me? This is mafu. Meme is also extra. Huh? So, brothers and sisters, what is on this vav? Now we make it into Islam. We make it shadda. So it changes into mad u one. We write it like this and we pronounce like that. So it's very easy, brothers and sisters. Let us read it quickly. The A Yadu Madhuvan invited. Madhu means one who's been invited. It is a regular. Means it's regular, no no changes taking place. It is written with one vow bearing Shadda. If it is written like this, Madhuvan, you see you can see the two vows. Eh? The first vow is of maf'ul. And the second vow is the lam kalima. Okay. Here is another example. Tala yatulu matlu wun. Matlu wun with shadda. Okay, brother and sister. Now comes bana yabni. But brother, bana make it into the pattern of maf'ulun. Mab. Nuyun, are you with me? That will be the original, but then it undergoes a change and it becomes Mabniyun. Huh? The wall change into Ya and other changes took place, brother. It, it's given, okay, brother. This is a mouth watering verb. What did I say? Mouth watering verb, especially lunchtime, brother. Huh? Shawa. What is the meaning of Shawa? To barbecue. <laughs> what do you barbecue, brother? <laughs> shava yashvi. So shava is shava ya. Make it into ism maful on its original pattern. Mash. No. Shava. Huh? Mashvu yun. Mashvu yun. It is shava ya. Mashvu yun. What will you say now? Mash vi yun. What will we say? Mashvi yun. Huh? What is the meaning of mashvi yun? Barbecued, grilled. I can smell the <laughs> uh, smell of kebab and uh, boti. <laughs> Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Please read this again. Then we can go through the lesson, inshallah, with a steady pace. And we will be able to finish lesson number five tomorrow, inshallah. Huh? Okay. I hope you find the lessons... Interesting. They are very interesting, brother. Rabbana 
آتینا فی دنیا حسنتا و فی الاخرت حسنتا و کینا عذاب النار ربنا حب لنا من ازواجینا و ذریعتینا قررت عیون و جعلنا للمتقین اماما ربنا ظلمنا انفسنا ان لم تغفر لنا و ترحمنا لا نكوننا من الخاسرين ربنا تقبل منا إنك أنت سميع العليم وتب علينا إنك أنت تواب الرحيم سبحان ربك رب العزة أما يصفون وسلامنا للمرسلين والحمد لله